if you're looking for a mentor, what you're actually looking for is somebody who obviously can mechanically give you feedback about your craft, about your skill, okay? But then also, if you don't have a mentor that's teaching you also like the life skills that are associated with it, like for instance, um, teaching you how to prep for interviews, how to land new clients, how to freelance, how to work in, like whatever it is you want to do specifically to your career path, your mentor should be able to speak into that aspect of your life, okay? So if you're gonna come to me and say, Jesse, I really wanna start freelancing, I'm gonna, I'm gonna critique your work, I'm gonna critique your portfolio that'll hopefully will land you work, I'm gonna talk to you about processes, where to find clients, I'm gonna talk to you about all those things. The things you should be asking are mechanical, are life skills, soft skills, how can I do this better? Can you give me feedback and critique on this thing? And then what you should really also be asking is for challenges and accountability. That's the biggest thing in a mentorship relationship is, hey, mentor of mine, I really want to do these things, okay? I want to get hired in the next year. Okay, great, that's a, that's a massive goal. Your mentor should be there to help you break it into smaller goals, right? And, and maybe maybe this isn't a mentor's job. I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking about more like a coach or a life coach. But it, you know, if, if I was going to mentor or coach somebody, I would want to help them break these big goals into smaller bite-sized goals and then give them challenges and say, I think you should do this. I expect this in the next three weeks. I expect that you would do this by you know month five or six. Like, let's go. Let's get it done. Where are you at on that? You want somebody who, who is challenging you, okay?